Want to learn how to set up your online business? Part two of Affiliate Marketing 101 starts right now. Hey guys, my name is Philip Watley, and for those of you that don't know, this is Life Without Boundaries. It's a channel where you can learn to make money online so that you can add to your income and break down the financial boundaries in your life. If any of that is something that could be valuable to you, go ahead and click the subscribe button at the bottom and turn on the bell notifications to let you know when I release new videos. So today we're going to go into a little bit more in-depth into affiliate marketing. Uh, if you missed the basics yesterday with Affiliate Marketing 101 video, I'm going to leave it for you up there. You just click it go check it out. Now where we left off yesterday, we were talking about uh, just the basic setup for uh, your website and your pages and your online business. We talked about choosing a niche, choosing a product in that niche, choosing a platform, and getting the right tools. After you've gotten done with these four steps, it's time to get started. So what you need to do is you need to start finding some content to make. Uh, like I'm on YouTube and my niche is making money online, so I'm making these videos, which is my content, to kind of reach an audience, to kind of get people interested in what I have to talk about and what I have to sell. So let's just, for the sake of this video, I'm gonna say YouTube videos. Oh, marker's running out. YouTube videos. So, I post my videos on YouTube. I keep telling people uh, about the links in the description, and that's where all of my products are going to be and information that I talk about in the video. Now you don't just want to put your products in there, you also want to put stuff about the video and links that might help out uh, relate the content to what you're talking about. So if I'm talking about five websites online, maybe I want to link those websites in the description. Um, but what you do is, is after you make your video your content, and in the video you tell people about your products or you review your products, and in the description has a link and when they click that link it'll take them to a landing page. Now the landing page is something that you make with ClickFunnels. Uh, it is a basically a page saying um, you know you clicked on this offer uh, my name is Philip Watley I really enjoy sharing content with you here is I'd like to give you uh, this thing that you clicked on but first put in your email. So we talked yesterday about capturing your email and making it permanent. That's your permanent lead forever. So ClickFunnels does that. Then it'll go to a bridge page or basically a thank you page saying thank you for putting your email in. And then after they do that, it immediately emails, let's do email box here. It'll go into the email and then email will give them your free offer, like my ebook or anything that you offer on your channel. So after they get their e offer, or when they click here, that's all gonna be sending to them while they go to this page. This next page gives them the real offer, like say I'm selling uh, ClickFunnel trials, like I am. So they would go and they'd check it out to see if ClickFunnels is something that they want to use. Oh. And that will take them to the actual ClickFunnels sales page in the trial. Uh, I've got to switch markers here. ClickFunnels sales page. Now, there's ways to, this isn't just the end, this is where we left off yesterday, but since you captured their email and they go through this and they're like, no, that's not for me. That's not the end of it. Like people very rarely buy the first time they're pitched on something. They have to be warmed up to the idea and they have to uh, know that the thing that they're gonna buy is gonna solve some problems for them and give them value. So what ClickFunnels does is it gives you some email autoresponders. So now that they're in your list and they go through and you, you're able to track if they bought the uh, product or not. If they haven't, then maybe after a day or two, you, it will send out another email to another landing page saying, you know, just telling your story with the product is the way you can sell better. Like, you know, before I had used ClickFunnels, uh, my business wasn't doing well and now I'm getting leads and 
And so you sell with stories and you just kind of tell them. And also, what you can also do, you can send auto emails promoting new content. So whenever you release a new video or release a new blog, you can send, tell ClickFunnels to send an email with links to your content in it. And then when they watch that new content, maybe you're selling something else. So maybe they subscribe, they didn't click the notification, like the bell notification to let them know you have a new video. Now you have a way to tell them you have a new video without them actually hitting that bell. So you send them an email, hey, check out, you know, I just made a video on top five uh, ways to uh, pay off your student loans. Now they know how to do it because you sent them a link. And in that link, you can plug in something else you're going to sell or try and resell them click funnels or anything else that you uh, use. So let's say they don't buy it again. That's okay. But you're building rapport with your uh, email people. Okay. You're not going to just keep telling, hey, buy click funnels, buy click funnels, buy click funnels. What you want to do is, is you want to just talk about your other content. Talk about how your product changes your life or or how well your product is doing, okay? And the things that's making it easier. So ClickFunnels is always coming out with new uh, products. It's not just the software. They have information books on um, learning uh, how to build a website, how to build a business, things like that. They have um, courses that you can take to help you learn ClickFunnels or even learn how to start a business. So there's lots of things that you can be redirecting and trying to sell them. If you're in a different niche, if you're in like weight loss, uh, maybe your first recommended thing was uh, a workout program, which would have given you, you know, a good commission. But since they're not interested in the workout program, like, okay, well, what can I give them that they'd be willing to pay for? So maybe something a little less expensive, maybe a protein shake, or maybe um, you know, a new recipe book to uh, for a specific diet. There's lots of things that you can keep selling people on your email list for. And that email that's why this email list is so important. It's not just people that go into your content. You can redirect your email list to your content. It's free views. You can redirect sales to your email list, which is more opportunity to make money. And you can grow a relationship with these people. Tell them, email back, ask me some questions, and build that rapport so that they can trust you. Trust is huge in sales. Nobody wants to buy something from somebody that they don't trust, okay? So you have to build that trust with your community. The first time I was, uh, when I was researching affiliate marketing, I uh, found this person and I was like, I like their videos and they have a free, free book. And so I decided to um, opt in and give them my email and they sent me some sales and I didn't, I didn't want to opt in right away because I, I didn't really understand what they were trying to sell. So I just kind of passed it up. Uh, but over time, after about a week, they kept mentioning this and how, you know, it's doing great things for them and they're able to make money. and. Uh, they're learning through these courses and I should probably, if I'm new, I should take these. And so I started understanding the product more through those emails because of that trust he was trying to build up with, uh, with me through my emails. And I was able to email him questions. He responded personally back uh, because a lot of times what you send them in the email is not going to answer their questions. You're going to have to do that. Okay. So building trust is huge. And this is, this is the affiliate marketing system. This is, this is pretty much it. Uh, building an email list through your content, giving away free things to bait them into getting on your email list, and then repeating the cycle. Consistency is key. And that's probably gonna be the last tip, maybe my black will work for this, is five, consistency. We talked a little bit about it yesterday. If you're not consistent, then your stuff won't get out there. The more content you have, the more chances that people will find what you're selling. So if you weren't here for yesterday's video, again, I'm going to 
let's do it this way. I think it's gonna be this way. Uh, it'll be showing up three, two, one, right there. There it is. Uh, and now you can watch that and learn a little bit more about affiliate marketing. Uh, remember to subscribe if you haven't down in the channel below and leave a comment because I really want to hear from you. All right, guys, I'll see you on the next video.